fun. And as we are a family here on Super K-Pop, I have decided to learn new languages every single day. Now, every day we'll have um, a sentence of the day, and you guys get to message me and uh, tell me how to say that sentence of the day in your language. Now, I think it's going pretty well. I must admit, the first day was a little tough. Uh, we had so many uh, messages come in, and I think we had maybe 30 new languages for me to learn. So, yes, I'm doing my best to learn all of them. My pronunciation, I know, is terrible. I actually checked my uh, Twitter on the first day, and um, I got a message uh, from a Dutch lady who was saying <laughs> my Dutch was terrible. It was not right at all. So I do apologize. I think Dutch is a very, very difficult language. I am trying my best to um, read Dutch, but it just seems so different to the actual pronunciation. So I would appreciate some more help in Dutch. So I think it was Danielle from Holland. So Danielle, if you're listening, please help me, okay? Please help me with Dutch. I think I'm doing all right on the other languages. But um, yes, I desperately need your help. But yes, um, guys, I hope you're enjoying that new corner. I certainly am. And uh, yes, tomorrow we'll have another sentence of the day. So please send in your messages. Right, play some more music now. Turn up the volume. This is JYJ in heaven. Come on, Kaike.
Okay, guys, we've got some more messages now. Gabriela uh, from Mexico. This is a message I actually got two days ago, and uh, but I really wanted to read it on the weekend because it says, Hi, Sam, how are you? This is my last day that I can hear Super K-pop. The reason is because my work. I'm a teacher, and the exams for my students are so close, so I have to stay with them all day. I have many groups, and I need to work so hard for them. They have to be successful with their exams. I hope I can get a fighting from you. I promise I'll try to listen to you at the weekend. Love you, and Lunafly fighting. So yes, that's the reason why I'm reading it now, Gabriella. I hope you're listening from Mexico. Um, yes, this is me reading out your message from a few days ago. And do you know what? Um, I really respect you for uh, working really hard for your students. I remember as a student myself when uh, I, I did have some favourite teachers and they were my favourites because they worked really hard for me and um, I really wanted to learn from them. So, uh, Gabriella, big respect to you and thank you so much for your message. David from Switzerland says... Hey Sam, I have to finish my music thesis in one week about Franz Schubert's Lindenbaum, Lime Tree. I admit that he is a genius, but it's so hard to analyze a song. Unfortunately, I'm a little bit... Um, uh, I'm having a little trouble, sorry, with my thesis, and I have no motivation to write it. Could you cheer me up, please? Kind regards, David from Switzerland. Do you know what, David? I know how you feel. I remember when I was in high school, uh, I studied music, and I uh, was analysing uh, Baroque music and Bach, I remember, and it was very difficult. But do you know what? Just keep plugging away, keep working hard, and I'm sure you will end up doing very, very well. So, yes, David, thank you very much for your message. OK, we come up to the end of the first half of the show, but do not go anywhere on part two. We will be talking about the super legends who created today's K-pop. The likes of TVXQ, Kim Gon Mo, Lena Park and Pak Kyo Shin. So, do not go anywhere. In the meantime, I'll leave you with Phone Tashinen. Pick up the phone. I'm 
Hear a wide variety of K-pop genres from 4 to 6 o'clock p.m. every day with myself, Sam Carter, on Super K-pop. Hello, 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 and welcome back to Super K-Pop. Right, guys, let me tell you once again how you can join us on the show. First, log on to www.adidangradio.com and click on the On Air button. Second, you can download the Adidang Radio app on your smartphone to listen. It's free for both Android and iPhone. Third, if you're in Jeju Island, turn your radio dials to 88.7 MHz in Jeju City, 88.1 MHz in Sogipo City, and 101.9 MHz in the Taejung area. And fourth, you can also tune in through SDMB Channel 64, TDMB Adidang Radio. No matter how you're tuning in, please log on to the website, adidangradio.com, and leave us your stories, request songs, answers to our quizzes, and your questions for me and my guests on the Super K-Pop message board. I shall be waiting. Okay, let's play some music. Sunny days with Bichinge Tlimopsa. I must be crazy. <laughs> Sunny days with Bichinge Tlimopsa. 